How to play scales on piano. If you know your notes, you can start playing scales on piano. We will take a look at three easy major scales. But first of all, I want you to know how your fingers are numbered. Piano finger numbers. Let's now learn the piano finger number system. Your fingers are numbered from one to five. On both the right and left hand, your thumb is finger 1, your index finger is finger 2, your middle finger is finger 3, your ring finger is finger 4, and your little or pinky finger is finger 5. It is very important to know how your fingers are numbered. Why? It's because songs normally point you towards what fingers you should use to play various keys on your piano. As you progress as a piano student, you need to know the correct fingering for scales, chords, arpeggios, and musical passages. By using the correct finger on a key, piano playing will be so much easier, and it will be comfortable for you. It will increase your speed as well, and make you more flexible. You will be able to execute new techniques and master awkward positions. By getting this right from the start, you will be well on your way to becoming a good or great piano player. So now that you know your finger numbers, let's play a C major scale. A scale is basically a group of notes that follow each other based on a specific pattern. The C major scale makes use of wide keys only. It consists of the notes C, D, E, F, G, a, B, C. Let's now play some scales. This will take some time to get used to, but with practice, you will be able to play these scales. How to play the C major scale with the right hand? Let's start with the right hand. When going up the C major scale, your thumb plays C, second finger plays D and third finger plays E. Your thumb then passes under your third finger and plays F. Second finger plays G. Third finger plays A. Fourth finger plays B. And fifth finger plays C. When going down the scale, the same fingers are used. Fifth finger plays C. Fourth finger plays B. Third finger plays A and second finger plays G. Then you continue with your thumb, where the thumb plays F, third finger plays E, second finger plays D, and first finger plays C. When going down the scale, the third finger goes over your thumb, giving you enough fingers to finish the scale. How to play the C major scale with the left hand? How about the left hand? When going up the C major scale with the left hand, finger 5 plays C, finger 4 plays D, finger 3 plays E, finger 2 plays F, and finger 1 plays G. Finger 3 now goes over finger 1 and plays A, then finger 2 plays B, and finger 1 plays C. When going down the scale, you simply play everything in reverse using the same fingers for each key. This means that finger 1 plays C, finger 2 plays B, then finger 3 plays A. Finger 1 now passes under finger 3 and plays G. Then finger 2 plays F, finger 3 plays E, finger 4 plays D, and finger 5 plays C. The left hand will be more challenging than the right. Keep practicing this skill until you are very comfortable with it. The more you play it, the better you will get. Practice makes perfect.